Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Legends Arceus Nuzlocke Challenge. <laughs> Where, uh, yeah, it's been one hot minute since uh, we since we uploaded here. I don't know if you guys are aware of this. We got insanely busy at the end of uh, 2022 there. We were uploading, we uploaded like, I don't know, like 12 videos in December. So that got kind of crazy. Plus we're doing box breakers over here. But I have not forgotten about our team. I have not forgotten. We are, we are here. We are near the end. And uh, I think the time has finally come. We went through last episode. We lost Storm, our Ursa Ring. Um, fighting that dumb Gudra, but uh, today, the day has finally come. I think we're going to add lasagna onto the team, which uh, you might think, uh, Jay, is that is that advisable? Because um, lasagna is dark poison, and you've already got, uh, you know, Gigi, who is dark poison, and you've already got uh, Rotera, who is dark. And you know what? The answer is, there's frankly no other Pokemon we have that are quite on the strength level we need. And uh, at this point, as far as I'm concerned, we are just Team Darkness. You know, we we are dark people. We've got three dark type Pokemon. Mercury is black anyway. Arnold, you know what? It's he's he's he looks he's look at those yellow eyes. He matches Mercury. Looks kind of evil. Luisa will you know? Destroy. Luisa's been here since the beginning, and we all know how vicious Luisa is. So we are we're just we're committed. We're committing to the darkness. That's where we're at in our uh, Pokemon journey. So what we're gonna do, hey, look at this. We can use this on Gigi. Let's do it. Ba-boom. Uh, increase that speed, man. Yeah, why not? Why not? Look, we have so much grit dust. Let's, let's improve some stuff. Let's improve defense. Yeah, oh, hold on. Let's go HP. So much GG power. Boost the alpha, especially. Why not? Just do it all. Do it all. Nope, now we're now we're maxed out there. That's fantastic. Let's go ahead and do this here as well. Let's go HP first. This feels like safe to always improve HP, right? You never you never have enough life. Um, I think we're just gonna go straight for attack. Bam, that looks good, that looks good. We're gonna go ahead and just discard all this mud because that seems pointless to have. Uh, so. The next couple things we have to do, we have to go to the other two caves to take on the guardians of, the, you know, what, whatever. Um, but before we do that, I think what we're going to do is just head out into the fields here because we can actually get lasagna to evolve if we can get it to use um, Barbarage Strong Style 20 times. So that doesn't seem like it's going to take that long. So I'm going to do a little bit of evolution work, stack our team as much as possible, go Team Darkness, go. Uh, where will you be heading? We're just going to be going um, to the to the most basic place we can go to just abuse this, right? Fieldlands Camp. Let's just go wreck some stuff, right? Right? I think so. Honestly, why? I don't. I don't know why you wouldn't. I don't know why you wouldn't. Um, so we're here. We go. Whoop! Can we back? Can we zoom out some here? Uh, and we're just going to go. Bam! Lasagna. Let's go wreck this Bidoof's day, man. Destroy it! Kill that thing! Oh, we have to use this Barbarage 20 times. It's gonna be so easy. Um, boom. Oh, can we not even do, oh yeah, we can. Okay, I was gonna say, wait. Strong style this guy. It's going down. There's one. Okay, I'm not gonna make you guys watch me do this 20 times. So let's do like um, a, little, a little fast motion grind session while I uh, just destroy some Bidoof's here with the team. And then we will, uh, we'll be right back. Oh, no. We'll be right back in time to evolve. Ready, get back here. You're going down. All right, see you in a second. All right, you guys. Training complete. Let's do some evolving. Yes, do it. Do it. Aw, oh, man, we're about to have some massive overquill on the team. So we should, that's, I mean, that's, that's effectively what our team is, right? Just team over, team, team overquill. Even though uh, lasagna has not really been on the team for very uh, uh, almost at all. Look at that thing, giant spike ball. We are unstoppable. We are so dark and poisonous. We are like the most toxic person you have ever known in your life. Um, let's see. We're going to go ahead and... Yeah, it's not going to matter. It's not going to matter. Look at that overcoil. Number caught. Boom. Biggity boom, boom, boom. All right. So where do we need to go next is the question. Uh, if we go to mission requests, we are at mission 15, Lake Valor in the Crimson Mirelands. All right, we are on route. 
Oh no, I don't want to talk to you. You weird, evil, probably guy. All right, uh, Irida, can you take us to a place? Uh, we need to go to the Crimson Islands, please, Carl. Can we go to Swamp? Yes. Let's go bog bound camp so we get up somewhere nice and high and just like eagle over to where we need to go. Lake Acuity, please. I think that's where we're going. So inside, unbelievably and fittingly, not unbelievable, um, very fittingly, what we're going to be doing is actually fighting against an overquill. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? Now, is that what's marked on the map right there? We want to go here. Valor Cavern. Boom. Pin it. Let's go. Where is it? Oh, oh, pfft. we're here. Hey, look at that. Well, I mean, we're here. We're there. We're almost everywhere. Something, something. Roy can't. We are, we're moving fast. We're flying. We're practically there. We're gonna go this way and then we're gonna get back on our deer friend. Ha, <laughs> get it, our deer friend, except I mean an actual deer. There we go. We're going, oh, evil carnivine. We had a carnivine once. I'm pretty, oh, wow, it got us. That is so surprising. We were moving at like topsimum speed there. Maximum effort. Oh, yeah, all right, let's see. There we go, fly. I guess I could have just surfed over, but that's no fun, right? We're gonna head in. Yeah, look at these guys. They've already beaten us here, as usual. Somehow they got here without bringing me. That's always so annoying. It's said Mo have been formed by volcanic eruption, much like Lake Verity, though there are also other theories that say it was carved out of the midst of a Pokemon battle. This place is, oh yeah, okay. Azelf, Azelf's probably my favorite of the guardians of the lake trio. Obviously, which is surprising because I want to say we've used Mesprit and Uxie. Yeah, we've actually used the other two before on Nuzlocke teams. But uh, on my own playthroughs, if I just given the choice, I would probably go for Azelf. Or at least that's the one I chose when I first played through Pearl so many years ago. So many years ago. Uh, let's see, though. Okay, so Overquill has several weaknesses. Um, the main one we're going to be trying to take advantage of is... We're going to use Rotera because what we want to hit it with is Shadow Ball. Actually, well, it's, it's weak to Ghost, so there is that. We, we, this is our most defensive Pokemon, I believe, right? 234? How is our... Um... Well, the other obvious option is Arnold because Arnold also is Ghost type and has Bitter Malice. Um, which, if we take a look here, he's got Power 60. So there is that, so we should keep that. Although you'll notice Arnold, only level 37, whereas Rotera, level 55. So significantly better. We have Shadow Ball, it'll be weak to Shadow Ball. We are way more defensive on that front. So we need to keep that in mind. We should take a look at Lasagna though. Let's just see, can we hit change moves? What else is it, what else do we have access to? Spikes, Pin Missile, Water, Double Edge. So nothing particularly great. Um, are we, yeah. I guess I should look more at the stats, shouldn't I? Uh, check summary. Let's see. Are we more? We are. We are more physical attack based than special attack based. Okay, and we have a lot. We have a lot of physical defense. This is actually a really good stat spread because we have very high defense that is getting boosted and low special attack, which is getting nerfed. So that is all good. That is all good. We like to see that. Um, we should check the moves. Okay, um, we are. What did I say? We're physically attack based. So Dark Pulse could probably be switched out for a more, um, some kind of dark, physical dark move if we have access to that. Do we? Uh, we don't. So we're going to keep Dark Pulse on there for the moment. Yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Um, yeah. So our main goal, I think, is going to be to get in there with Fraterra and basically just wreck him. No problem. Hit him with some Shadow Balls. That'll be that. Um... Anything else we should be aware of? We could calm mind. We could calm mind at the beginning of the fight just to like boost our own defenses. Always a good call. Always a good call. Um, so there is that. And what does Snarl do again? This lowers their offensive stats. So if we find ourselves in a situation where they've like half hit us or something, um, we can always Snarl and lower their ability to do that. Uh, this attack doesn't miss. So if they're just at low health and we don't want to like risk anything, not that it really matters because we've got, um, well, Sometimes Pokemon, they'll have like those like mist moves that stop you from 
uh, hitting them. So if that happens, we can also Dark Pulse. So rotero has got almost everything covered that we could want it to do. So I think Calm Mind and then hit it with some Shadow Balls. And hopefully uh, that's just enough. And it just, everything is just, everything works, right? It's, it, 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 it'll just work. Everything's gonna be great. And yeah, yes, yeah, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Let's head in. That's our plan for fighting the Overquill. Oh, here's Irido, some bad graphic rendering. What an eerie space. Why would there be columns inside of a cave anyway? Oh my gosh. It looks so angry. Almost as cool as ours. Watch yourself, Jay. Those quills look vicious. They sure do. They sure do. Oh my gosh. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's just, let's, let's, do we, do, wait, do we have, do we, do we, what, do we, do we, do we have, Potions? Can we craft a super potion of something? Craft a super potion pep up plant. Can we, we can craft one? Well. What? That feels worth it. Okay. Uh, so now what do we have in the potions department? We have a hyper potion. So we're looking so prepared. We are... So prepared. We are definitely not going to need that hyper potion. We are just going to um, be awesome. That's how it's going to work. Let's fight this thing. Oh my god, it looks so angry. It is so. It is so our vibe, though, right? It's going down. It's going down. All right, go Rutera. Boom. Oh my gosh, Umbra looks so good in this game. Filled with might. Oh my god, it's already poison jabbing us. Yep, don't get poisoned. Yeah, we got poison, so that's a bummer. Um, let's so I like so much of me just wants to know how much this does. Can we one shot it? Almost definitely not, right? Um, oh, return your next turn becomes more likely to come sooner. Let's do a regular Calm Mind. I think that makes the most sense. If we have to Hyper Potion after this, then we do it, you know? Now we're boosted. Offensive stats were raised, defensive stats were raised. We are in a good position. Minus that nasty poison, it's gonna hurt itself. We don't like that. It's damaged by the recoil, okay? Now, exactly, we have exactly where we want it. Now we are, in fact, going to go ahead and just use this, because you know, we don't have much of a choice. Um, let's go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Rotera cures itself of poison. Oh my god, that wasn't even enough. Oh my gosh. Double edge. It hits itself again. Okay, it's just double edging itself though. It seems like it just poisoned us for the sake of it, and now we are going to shadow ball it right in its dumb face. Take it! Kill it! Kill it with shadows! Oh my gosh, that was a crit! Oh, we're so screwed. Oh no. Rotera was cured of its poisoning. <gasps> gonna hit itself oh no see now it'd be so good if we had more potions but we don't shit do doshins but we do but we don't oh wow no because now we cannot heal um all we have is an orange berry and this cherry berry this will only do 60 health return so so i don't love that bit of situation because we can desperately not lose Rotera. I don't think, and we're not going to knock it out. This is the thing. We're not going to knock it out if we fight. Um, we will not knock it out with that Shadow Ball. We don't have like the option to strong. To strong. Gosh. What if we, what if we, hold on. Okay. Let me think about this. What if we, not very effective. Actively not effective. Are all of these saying not effective? Are we sure about that? Shouldn't ghost be good against jar? Oh gosh, okay. Um, we're gonna have to, we definitely can't fight. Oh gosh, oh gosh, okay. What we need to do is go into, who is our next most defensive Pokemon is the question. Who is our, we want someone who has good physical defense. Um, 132, 234. So that's already 189, 175, 166, 132. So the answer as usual is Big Merc. 
question is what can Mercury hit it with? Oh man, I mean, we can just hit it with the good old fashioned Thunder Fang, right? This is what we're gonna have to do. This is what we're gonna have to do. Oh my gosh, here we go. We don't have much options though. You have got to, um, poison jab. Don't, just, okay, so, and it didn't poison us. So that's very, very good. Paralyzes the target is very good because then we can just go again and they'll be paralyzed anyway, but uh, It feels like we need to do this. I'm gonna do this because we get to go again anyway We're going agile style on it. Avoided the attack oh, we're so screwed. How did it avoid the attack? Oh, we're so screwed. We're so screwed now. Okay, okay, here's what we can do. Here's what we can do. We can go to Gigi who will just resist. No, not Gigi. We have to go into our own. Oh my gosh, we're so screwed. We're going into our own lasagna who will resist all of these dumb attacks. I cannot believe we missed with that thunder wave. Mercury, what is happening? It was just a, oh my gosh, it's, it's overquill on overquill. Oh, damage by the recoil, no! It did so much damage. It did well over half. If it does that again, we're dead. We're just taking hits now. Okay, this is so bad. This is so bad. 180. Uh, Louisa has 300 hit points. That has got to be enough to take a hit, right? And then, okay, okay. Louisa, you can do this. You can do this. That thing is going down because you're a beast and you will destroy this thing. Oh, and we get to go. And we get to go. We get to go first. Should we bulk? Should we bulk or should we just go straight for the aqua tail? Oh my gosh, it's only 90% accuracy and it's already dodged the thunder wave. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Crunch is ineffective. Ice punch, aqua tail's our best bet, power 85. But should we bulk? No, we just got it. We hear, you know what? We're all in on the aqua tail. Do not you dare miss. Oh, we got it. Luisa! Oh, it was nerve wracking. Oh, it was nerve wracking. I thought we were gonna lose someone, but we didn't. We worked together as a team. We wore it down. We let it use its own attacks that hit itself with recoil damage. Oh my gosh. The thunder wave would have helped. It would have helped a lot. Uh, I can't believe we missed that, but the, the good news is everyone survived. <gasps> as elf, there we go. All right, Beautimus. Beautimus, show to me unyielding will. Strike me if you can. All right, if you say so. Hey, look, bombs. Pretty sure we invented those earlier this week, but um, you know, if you if you got them, uh, look, it's just gonna be like, nah, you can't hit me, bro. I'm too fast. I'm too good. Burp! Nah, you can't hit me. Where'd it go? Burp! Nah, you can't hit me. Nah, it just does this for a while. And then eventually it's like, do you give up? Like, no, we're unyielding. Come on, man. Will you abandon this folly? I'm not through yet. Mm -hmm. Come on, little Jay, you got it. Things gone? He wants to be weird and cheap like that? Here we go. Where'd you go? It's like the same thing. I'm not through yet. Here we go. All right, we've almost got it. We've almost got it. Keep trying until the very end. The game's like, yeah, this is just how it goes. It'd be really funny if they made you do this like a hundred times or something and it was just like, yeah, no, this is just it. Did I actually miss it? All right, now now we're probably good. You seem to hear a voice inside your head. Give up, you struggle in vain. Not through yet. All right, yeah, we get it. Okay, come on, man. And now that we can hit it. Yeah. Take it. 
take this piece of the spirit to bind the world once more. Yay, we did it! Oh my gosh, I was so nervous that Overquill was gonna get us. Freaking Louisa, so strong, so powerful. You obtained Azel's Fang. Lovely, haha. Proof that you completed the trial by Azel. Is this a letter? Okay. All right, now we have to head to the next one. That looked exhausting, but only one more to go now. Okay, we can do it, we can do it. Are my Pokemon healed? No. Oh my gosh, we desperately need more potions. That was part of it too. We did use the Hyper Potion and it did help us. Um, it hurt, hit for some of that recoil damage. So there is that to consider. We need those pep up plants. That's the problem. We can't make more potions. Just gotta buy the pep up plants. Can you buy them from him? I assume all went well, Jay. Still, I must wonder. Why don't they just give us the red chain? Why are they just running about? Hey man, sometimes you gotta earn it, dude. You gotta be worthy, dude. Uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Who could say for sure? Maybe the red chain has some other use besides mending the world. Yes, what other use could it have, suspicious man? So, shall we return to Mistress Kojita's home? Yeah, let's go back. All right, let's go. Bye-bye. Wonderful. Yeah. All right, we did it. We got one down, one to go. Now we just have to do whatever the next one is. Uh, I forget what actually the next um, thing we're fighting is. We've done the Gudra, and we did the Overquill. Uh, oh, it might be the Zorark. It might actually just be Zorark. Um, and if that's it, then I guess we just want to hit it with the strongest physical attacker we have with just anything. You can't hit it. It's like normal ghost, so you can't actually hit it with fighting type moves, which is what it would otherwise be weak to. But I think you can just hit it with like dark, right? It should, that should work if it's ghost. Um, and we have dark! We have dark in spades, but of course, what we have to remember is that, um, <clears throat> excuse me, it is a glass cannon and it is fast, so it will hit hard at least once, probably. What are we doing? I'm not even reading what they're saying. I do think it's the Hisuian Zorark, though. Um, investigate what? I want to heal my Pokemon. Are they healed? Yay, they're healed. All right, you, can you sell me some pep up plants or something, man? What are you guys growing over here? Oh, no. I guess I can just get the potions, right? Is this fine? I'm gonna get a bunch. Well, no, because that's not even the problem. It's not that we don't have the potions, it's that we don't have the, the mixing ingredients. Um, we can sell all these. That's something. Uh, but it's not really, it's not really the problem, is it? Because what we don't have is... Yeah, we can't make this because we don't have the pep-up plant! And then we also don't have the Vivichokes, so... I've been selling the Vivichokes the whole game, I'm like, we don't need these! <laughs> uh, maybe I have some in the trunk, though? Maybe actually, maybe I have been saving some. Um, nope, I haven't. Have I said the vivid jokes? Also, no. Okay, so we've prepared poorly in that regard. Um, it's it's true, it's true. But maybe we don't even need any potions, right? Is there an obvious place to 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 get the to get the 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 stuff? You know, to get the stuff. Uh, can I talk to someone else before I go? That maybe maybe that's the case. Or can I, what if you go to the crafting station? Can you? No, not really. Okay, um, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna see if I can buy any of the ingredients from one of the other dudes, or if it's all a matter of harvesting. Um, let's just go to whatever here. Yeah, doesn't matter. <sighs> if we can buy the pup-up plants, that'd be amazing, because then I would just uh, buy a ton and Let's see, heading to the walls better prepared. I want to do some shopping. Nope. All right. They have such limited supplies. That is a bummer. And we can't go back into town, right? That's another thing, ancient retreat. Yeah, we're just going back to the ancient retreat. All right, well, unless we want to sit here and mine pep up plants, I think we just go fight the, um, fight the dude, as it were. Uh, 
I guess I don't even know where to go to mine them. So we're just gonna, yeah, we're, we're not gonna worry about that. We're just gonna um, accept that I'm gonna, I guess I can double check what we're up against, right? I'm assuming it's the Zorark, but I don't actually even know. Hold please. Okay, yeah, it's the Zorark. And uh, I think I think we are in a pretty solid spot because basically, yeah, it, um, we're just gonna, we have dark type Pokemon and that's what it's weak against. So um, we're gonna be set, I think. Uh, we're gonna probably have the exact same game plan. Head in with Rotera, probably Calm Mind, hit it with a, uh, hit it with a Dark Pulse or uh, switch to lasagna if we have to. And that's gonna, uh, that's probably gonna be what we're gonna do, right? I guess if it tries to use ghost attacks, we could switch it into Arnold, although our Arnold is um, not gonna be as powerful as the one we're up against since we're only level 37. But regardless, here we go. Where are we heading? We're heading to the Alabaster Icelands. Yes. <laughs> Bada boom. All right, oh my goodness. Can we take down Uxie's trial? as well oh my oh my oh my oh my let's see we want uh yeah go ahead grab some experience man while we're here why not why not um where are we heading is the real question we are heading to can i oh lost satchel acuity cavern yeah i can't like go to any other camps though yeah, no. All right, so we're gonna just get up high. Well, I should have marked it on the map. Make acuity, yeah, there we go. Mark it, ba-boom. Um, but that was nice, we just like flew right up here. And then we'll go right there and we'll climb up here with Sneasler. Yay, grab some crunchy salt, yum, yum, yum. Grab some more crunchy salt, yum, yum, yum. Oh yeah, we are up high, y'all. We are up high, and we're gonna go fly over there. It's gonna be uh, so fast. Woohoo! And we're off. It is so much faster once you get this thing. Every the whole game is just so much easier. It's like you know they just gave this to you at the beginning. The other ones almost don't matter either. It's like. Oh, oh, yeah, you can run around fast, but once you can fly, I mean, whatever, it's so, like, here we go. Imagine if we were running, how long would that take? Look at that, look at what's happening down there. What's that cave? I'm so curious. We'll have to check that out later. We'll have to check that out later. Instead, we're just going to run straight into this wall and sneezel our way up. Chicka pow! Here we go. Bam, 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 bam. Sneasel, sneasel, sneasel. Lake Acuity, here we are at long last. Oh, it's a pep-up plant! No way! It's like they could tell. It's like they could tell. Maybe we could find another one. Hold on. Could we find another one? That'd be so wonderful if we could. Oh, what was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? Oh, it's this thing. Okay, so that's something. That's the spear tomb. Um, not exactly what we're looking for, but the good news is, with the pep up plant, we can now go ahead and make at least a somewhat better potion, uh, right? Yeah. All right, there we go. That's better than nothing. We don't have a vivid choke, so we can't go to hyper potion, but that's just gonna have to do it. That's, that's where we're at, I'm afraid. Um, unless there's just like some around here that they're like, oh yeah, you'll probably need that. Unless the game is trying to gift you things. Which it doesn't look like they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, no big deal. We're just gonna head in and we're not gonna need, we're not gonna need potions. Who needs potions? No one I've ever met, okay, right? We're not, we didn't use one in the last fight. This is gonna be great. It's gonna be easy. We're gonna punch it. And it's a glass cannon, and it will—it's it, gonna live up to that name, and it's—it's uh, it's not gonna kill us, and we are gonna kill it, and that will be that. Exactly, it's gonna work perfectly, perfectly. A tool that can make caves simply appear from nowhere—it's quite a handy one to have. I wonder what waits inside. Yeah, I know. Well, I imagine there may be Pokemon in there, protecting the Lake's Guardian. Take care. 
Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. We have our plan. The only real question is whether or not we should use, like, is if we look at our own um, Zorark, like, the special defense, actually the special defense is worse than defense. So actually, yeah, I was gonna say, maybe there's a argument to use lasagna instead of Rotera, but there's not. Um, we're just gonna go in and we're gonna win. It's gonna be um, one, two, three. I sense a chill in the air. What is this? <gasps> a menacing Pokemon stands before you. Oh yeah, could, could this be the dreaded baneful fox? Oh, it is all right, it is. <gasps> Don't think, just do it. Uh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Go, go! All right. The Baneful Fox Pokemon is going down. It is so dead. Go, Rotera. No problem at all. We're just gonna wreck this thing without, filled with might, yeah, whatever. Okay, Shadow Claw, weak, nothing, not effective at all. We're gonna Calm Mind. We're just gonna be real safe about it since we don't have any potions. Um, it's gonna be great. Offensive stats were raised, defensive stats were raised. Yay, Shadow Claw, also worthless. Yep, no good at all. And now we fight and we go straight up Dark Pulse. Can't miss, let's see how we do. Boom, one shot! We didn't even need to comp, maybe we, maybe because of the comp mine, but just like that, Rotera is so good. And look at that, fittingly, our own Hisui and Zorark leveled up, that's fantastic, oh my gosh. Yes, we did it, y'all, we did it. Man, man alive, the Baneful Fox. The Pokemon said to be filled with malice. We were told stories about it as children. Yeah, well, I've got one on my team, Yurida. So, you feel a mysterious presence. What could it be? What could it be? Duh. <laughs> All right, let's go talk to this dude. <laughs> Come, I will test your knowledge. All right, Combi, Zubat. Unknown, Magneton, Dusclops. How many are their eyes? Okay, hold on. Combi has six eyes. Right? Okay. Because it has the three. Zubat has... Zero? Unknown has one. Magneton has three. And Dusclops has one. So, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven? Right? Is that right? Is that right? Tell me each. One by one, yet all at once. Or is it that in a row? Six oh six zero one three one. Enter your answers together as a series of numbers. Oh, okay, so six zero one three one. Okay, right? Okay. Because Zubat has like those slits. That's the, that's the trick. Is that right? Oh, we got it. Okay. Fairly impressed with myself. <laughs> I know, sorry about that hard. Um, we got it. Ooksy's Claw, yay. <laughs> Amazing, you cleared all three trials of the lake. You really are a wonder. I know, I know, no reason. I got it, you know, I'm amazing. All right, you guys, well, we've cleared out the last two trials, which means we can, I think, uh, from here, we head up the mountain and we can finally go fight, uh, I wanna say Dialga, since we sided with the Pearl Clan. I think that means we fight Dialga and we get to use Palkia. Uh, so that's cool, but I think in front of that are like several pretty hard trainer battles, if I can recall. So we might need to do a little bit of grinding before we get there, uh, specifically to get Mr. Arnold and um, Miss Gigi up to snuff. But uh, we are we are very close. We are getting there. Um, we are towards the end. Pretty excited. Whew. 
Hope you guys are having a uh, wonderful new year. I hope you're enjoying Box Breakers as well. Uh, if you don't know about Box Breakers, it's where we, me and Ben are opening up Pokemon cards right here on the channel. And then um, uh, you get the cards we open if you're signed up in a tier in Patreon. So if you want to, if you want to like be a part of the game itself, you can just go to uh, SuperCarlin Gaming slash, or Patreon.com slash SuperCarlin Gaming. <laughs> Um, otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like the video and leave a comment so we can name Pokemon after you. Otherwise, until next time, bye. And before we go, I want to give a huge shout out to all of our amazing supporters over on Patreon. I used to be able to read out every single person's name, but you guys have been so awesome and so many people have joined that I, I don't think I have the time to read out every single name anymore. But big, big thank you to every single person who's supporting us over there. If you'd like to see your name on this wall, or if you'd like to take part in our other show on this channel, Box Breakers, where we open Pokemon cards and then send them to you guys, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. Thanks again, everyone. Dead spork.